In this video, we will look at examples of groups, part two. In this video, we will focus mainly on additive groups. Consider the set of integers mod n under the operation O+. Plus. Remember that the operation O+, plus from Zn cross Zn to Zn, is defined by A O plus B equals the quantity A plus B mod n. Here we will prove that Z mod n under the operation O plus is a commutative or abelian group. To show that the set of integers mod n under the binary operation O plus is a commutative group, we need to show that it satisfies the identity, inverse, associative, and commutative requirements. For the identity requirement, let A be any element in Z mod n. Then, A, O plus 0, is equal to the quantity A plus 0 mod n, which is equal to A mod n, which is equal to A. Also, 0, O plus A, equals 0 plus A mod n, which is equal to A mod n, which is equal to A. Thus, 0 is the additive identity in Z mod n. For the inverse requirement, let A be any element in Z mod n, and consider the quantity n minus A, which is also in Zn. If we apply the binary operation O plus to A and the quantity n minus A in either order, the result is 0 both times. Thus, the inverse of any element A in Z mod n is the quantity n minus A. Finally, we have stated previously that addition of integers is both associative and commutative, so these properties are automatically satisfied. Since the set of integers mod n under the binary operation O plus satisfies all four requirements, it is therefore a commutative or abelian group. As an example, consider the set of integers mod 13 under the binary operation O plus as stated previously. In this set, find the inverse elements of 1, 5, 7, 8, and 11. Here are the solutions to these additive inverse examples.